Human communication has always been multimodal. In our interaction with each other, we smile, we use intonation, we gesture, and we read each other from the way we walk, the way we talk, how we dress. These aspects of human communication are hard to study. So we created the distributed Little Red Hen Lab to take really hard workers worldwide who are researchers to create something that's never existed before. It's a collaborative of red hens, all of them working, but working cooperatively so that whatever one of our teams develops, all of the teams can share. Newscape is designed to develop, refine, and perfect techniques of dealing with a full spectrum of, of human multimodal communication and to do so in a way that allows us to be both producers and consumers of information and to exchange this information along peer-to-peer -peer networks and not merely in the centralized broadcast model uh, that has tended to dominate the age of television. Text, language, sound, vision, gesture, these are all parts of human multimodal communication. Our data sets are meant to help us analyze all of this. The result is that we get a set of tools, and the tools are not attached to any particular data set, and this opens up a number of disciplinary opportunities. So we now have a fully searchable audiovisual library with hundreds of thousands of hours of television news broadcasts from stations from around the world. This is already changing our research careers because now we can do things and we can ask questions that we could simply not imagine before this resource existed. We can perform searches for specific linguistic expressions in different languages from around the world in the three billion word archive of subtitles that we have. And we can at the same time synchronize those searches with image, sound, prosody and all the other multimodal aspects that accompany verbal communication. From beginning to end. From beginning to end. <laughs> from beginning to end. It's like from beginning to an end. It's up to you to decide what new research you can do to make the most of the Red Hand Lab and the Newscape Library. It's up to you to decide what kind of Red Hand you are. <laughs>